So why didn't you guys ever even try being together? I mean, uh, after Andy was out of the picture, you were right there. Yeah, you know? I don't know, man. Just too much of familiarity, you know, like. It's like she's one of my limbs or something. Like she's part of my body, you know? And that's bad because. I don't know how you get to be the most important person to your person and not miss out on having a kid. You want to be already divorced with a kid so you can meet the man of your dreams? love each other, we trust each other, we're responsible, gainfully employed, and totally not attracted to each other physically. Yeah, that'd be perfect. I can't really tell if you're kidding right now. We have the kids, share all the responsibility, and just skip over the whole marriage and divorce night. What if I wasn't? What? You're kidding. Really? Just, what if? And tell me that you will be 100% committed to this half the time. I will be 100% committed to this half the time, maybe even more. Let's just roll the dice and see what happens, right? That's a, it's just a life. May I approach the bench? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah? Yeah. Okay. You made a totally irresponsible decision about a kid. Do you really think he's gonna be okay later when he finds out that his parents never loved each other, even when they had him? <laughs> Why don't you, you stop you. hitting me? It's a pain in the ass. Let's just pretend we're really into each other. You think that I haven't thought this through? You think that you think that we don't love each other? You know, I've loved this girl for 19 years, Ben. That is fully half my life. I know everything there is to know about her. I know the mood she's in when she wakes up in the morning, always happy, ready for the day. Can you imagine? I know that we have the same values. We have the, the, the same taste. We have the same sense of humor. Slow, painful death by disease or watching the love of your life die a slow, painful death by disease. I know that if she is ever paralyzed from the neck down, she would like me to unplug her, and I will. A. Definitely A. I know her position on just about everything, and I am on board. I am on board with everything about her. So you tell me, Ben, what better woman could I have picked to be the mother of my child? Seriously. What more responsible choice could I have made? I just wanted to be with family. I want Daddy to sleep in our house. You're my family. What does Daddy do to sleep in our house? I'm so in love with you, I don't know what to do. Oh, honey. It's okay. This is too much. I love you. Best friend. It's amazing how fleeting it is, you know? That thing, whatever it is. She is so cool and smart and talented. Being into someone new. She's moving in with me. That's why you stay with someone you want to be with under the worst possible circumstances. Kurt is the nicest, most caring man I have ever dated. Yeah, he adores you. It's obvious. But all I do when I'm with him is think about you. You're my best friend. I'm just not attracted to you. I mean, God knows you're attractive. You are. You are beautiful. I'm just... I can't be close to you anymore. I wish I could sleep at your house, but... I don't want to stay in your house. I can't say shit like that. I know. I kid. You understand I know. That? I'm sorry. I just, um... I'm not angry at you. I'm not pining for you. I'm dating a lot. I'm good. That we would raise a kid together so we could still have the romantic part. Right? But you see, this... This was the romantic part. Everything we had was the romantic part. What am I supposed to do with that? Just go.
come in here and say all that great stuff and I'm supposed to just just believe you all of a sudden I mean after look, everything that look, we've been I know what I said I know what I said that night and, and I, 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 all, all I can say is I I, I wasn't ready I miss you so much. And don't you miss me at all? You've been a little. I miss you a little. Yeah. I had a really dirty dream about her. Really? Yeah. But see, I'm not just gonna be with someone who's not into me. You feel like not into you? Yeah. I know, I just really want to have sex with you. And if you're not convinced afterwards that I am into you, in every possible way a person can be into another person, then I promise I will never try to kiss you, or fuck you, or impregnate you ever again, as long as I live, I swear to God. I had never had a love of my life, okay? I, I, I mean, I, I didn't know I did. I was just too fucking stupid to realize it. Look, I know my timing sucks, but uh, you're the love of my life, Joel. You're my person, and it's just the way it is. Please. What do you say?